You were shocked to find it so early in your first playthrough? Well, I think it's kind of a, maybe it's a, a tamer version. I know, I remember having to fight one later on. I feel like that one was Once out of control. <laughs> Fix the system, heal the blight. Oh, you have a free pass to Game Pass? It is, yeah. Later snakes are more different. Yeah, it's just a really awesome design. I really like it. You wanted to fight this when you saw it in the trailers? Yeah, because it's so cool. I mean, I was really impressed with the changes, or not the changes, but the upgrades and the different types of bosses that they that they came out with when they, when they released this. Honestly, the only thing that I really disliked or I wasn't really happy with when I played this the first time around was the story. Is the ending. Please be here. I did not understand. I didn't understand Tilda. I didn't understand. The decision behind. That. That was just my opinion. It's here. Gaia version. Gaia! Gaia version 6.9. Nice. <laughs> Hi. Elizabeth? Travis Tate. Now, what's this we got here? A Farzine's conspiracy to steal a copy of Gaia? And her subordinate functions? Naughty, naughty. Naughty, naughty. <laughs> Thou shall not steal super advanced terraforming system. Yeah, she obsessed over for a millennium. I wish that they would have switched. I wish that the final fight, w if the final fight wasn't Tilda, I think it would have been okay. Aloy? The goddess. There is no goddess. I told you that already. That's not Gaia. That's not what I'm looking for. It's nothing but a fake. You like the ending battle in stages? I did this. I did this in on very hard. The first time I played it and I want to say that final fight took me hours to beat. I died so many times. Maybe I just didn't have the right thing set up but I just could not get an elemental build up. I'm sorry. You have a sharp bite sometimes you know. But it was pretty amazing to see you fly off that tower and blow up the entire basin. The thing is, um, there's going to be more of that. I'm out of leads, Farl. But I, I have to keep searching. And fast, and whatever risks I have to take, I will. And it doesn't make sense to have someone with me. Someone who might get hurt. This Don't be mean to Varl. Nobody else. Hold on. Before, in Meridian, you said there was a man who helped you. Silence. You said you used to talk to him a lot about things you discovered from the old world, things no one else understands. 
and he gave you the lance you used to defeat Hades. He's gone, Varl. I haven't heard from him since the battle against Hades. Sure, but Spymaster Mirad back in Meridian, he's good at finding people, isn't he? <laughs> You're also a Varl beard person. Come Wait, who on, else said to keep the beard? Plus, you'll get to see some friendly faces. Oh, it was Doc, I think. Okay. I... I guess it's worth a shot. We've got a long walk ahead. Actually, I've got a better idea. Oh, <laughs> <Aww>, Varl. <laughs> Look at its face. Savior of Meridian has returned. You earned this welcome. You saved them. Not yet. In the name of the Sun King of Vard, a royal welcome for the champion. Make way. Murat, Aloy has an urgent matter to discuss. Dashane, that makes two of us. I've sent forth hunters for weeks. The sun fall all the way to the sacred land, searching for you. Something happened at the spire. Come. I'll show you. Why did they make him shave it? I think at this Too part it's supposed to emphasize how long he's been searching for her, maybe? We're still cleaning up the mess. It happened right after the solstice. We were able to explain it away, thank the sun. Otherwise, it might have caused a panic. Oh, look. You got a statue. One night, for less than half a minute, it glowed and from Meridian, it looked like a trick of the light. But those who were closer, atop the light, said it could not have been a reflection. Much to my dismay, they said the light rose up from the tower's base. From that. We left everything just as it was. What do you think happened? I don't know. The Spire is supposed to send out signals, messages, for the terraforming system. But Hades tried to use it to wake up ancient war machines. I was sure I got the connection to that thing. Wait here while I check it out. Let us know what you find. <laughs> it's too difficult to animate as my real guess. That makes sense too. <laughs> Is that, I've got a bad feeling about this. I, I could pull this thing out of my What? Silent sneaky sneaky. No, he wouldn't. He couldn't. Something was transmitted from the top of the spire. I guess I have to find a way up there. Many people miss the mark on this game being character development for Aloy. I felt. I think it's just really hard to compare the character development here where she's you know, big and badass now, as opposed to, like, in Zero Dawn, where she was finding herself. And she went from being really weak and an outcast and a child 
to being the savior of the world. So I think there's just a lot bigger of a discrepancy. It was just a lot easier to see in Zero Dawn, but... There's only so much character development you can... I guess do. I found Aloy. I was not... I found Aloy to be a little insufferable in my first playthrough. Uh, especially in the beginning. This time around, I think it's fine, but I also kind of know what happens. Should be able to jump back and reach those ropes behind me. L2. Oh. There we go. The girl is stressed. Fair. Now, how to cross over to the spire. Should be able to get up there now. Silence was helping me when he gave me his lance. But it looks like he tricked me. It transmitted something through the spire. Did he save Hades? Why would he do that? Well, if I can figure out where he sent it, I can track him down. Hopefully the transmission note at the top will tell me. In this one you can really see how her upbringing affected her. Well, I like I can keep climbing this way. In the beginning. The part where people found her insufferable, right? Because she, she's very much alone. She wanted to be alone, and she felt like she had to do it alone. Hey, little girl, where are we going? Reach out. What's there? Oh, I see. I see you. Panels ajar. Can I go up through the inside? And to save the world. Yeah, I feel like I have no problem. I, I am fine with her. You know this playthrough. Let's see. Access lift activated. Why is there yarn on the floor? The whole thing is opening up. Wonder what the cards will make of this. I see you finally figured it out. Hi, Silence. To be honest, I'm surprised it took you so long to discover my rules. You raped the lands to steal Hades. How could you be so reckless? Reckless? You're the one who tried to purge Hades before its precious knowledge could be extracted. The mysterious signal that woke it, for example. But why don't take one of those guy backups you've been having such a hard time finding? If you knew, why didn't you just tell me? I've been having problems of my own these past six months, Eloy. The difference is, I've made progress. So once your anger at my entirely necessary deception has faded, then why don't you come out here and find me in the Forbidden West and learn all that I've discovered? Oh, how good friends you are, Yes. Well, in the course 
coordinates make it simple enough. Even for you. inside it and it transformed almost like the day of the battle I can only be grateful that it's a stormy day few will have seen the tower change from Meridian what did you discover <laughs> the danger didn't end here it went into the Forbidden West and I have to go. see that can be difficult the West is called forbidden for a reason a tribe of ferocious warriors controls much of it, the Tanakh, and they allow no trespassers past its border. That said, under the Sun King of Ard, uh, a fragile peace has been negotiated, and indeed, the next embassy will take place in a day or two on the edge of the frontier. Were you to attend the gathering under his auspices, the Tanakh might grant right of passage, instead of hunting you and attacking on sight. Great, just what I need. More killers. I think also I didn't really like the beginning because it just felt like everybody was trying to date Aloy. Because I also felt like Sadikio did, and I felt Aloy. like Varl was trying to it's date her in the beginning. And then the same with him. We never had a chance to properly thank you. Can, can we show the champion the spear now, please? It's a min. Quiet. It's true. We bear gifts. Decorum usually calls for a ceremony of honor. And errand, yes. But I yeah. You would Everyone wanted her, yeah. Location. Bring them, please. Uh, Avad, this is all very kind, but I... Who's it? Vinasha. Quick. Better hand them over before she runs off again. Really? Must you? <laughs> Try it on. It's beautiful. On behalf of all the citizens of the Sundom, may these tokens remind you of our eternal gratitude. Perhaps you'd like to spend more time with your friends. Come speak to me when you're ready to depart. Should be a workbench around here I can use. Toggle the visibility of Aloy's headpiece. You need to increase your concentration IRL. I feel that. Can modify my sphere. Hi, Avad. The sculptor wanted something even bigger, twice the size, covered in gold. Look at survivability. Gold. Which one is that under? I was quite certain you wouldn't appreciate that. You were right. I'm sorry, Avad. It's good to see you. Survivor. Oh, <laughs> makes sense. I see. I had hoped you'd remain in the city for a time. Perhaps at the palace. Meridian's still in danger. But it's bigger than that. To put things right, I have to go west. Tanakh. Yeah, Avid, yeah Avad wants her too. Tanakh? Well, perhaps Murad already told you, but... But he didn't he tried to get her to stay at the end of Zero Dawn. The embassy will be held in just a day or two. What makes this coming embassy so special? Not just like today, it is special because of the guest. 
Our delegation will meet with the Tanakh just outside Baron Light. We'll give them treasure, and they'll return a prisoner. And Petra, yeah. <laughs> the finest soldiers. Soldier? Don't you mean Raider? No. Not in this case. Vashav is my cousin. Nothing like Helis and his ilk. He joined the Western Expedition with the hopes of reining in certain excesses. But he was captured during a heroic defense of our forward base at Cinnabar Sands. And has been held ever since. I think... I think the difference between Aloy and... Or what makes Aloy so different when it comes to that is because she's so against it. Like, I think in every other game, when you get hit on by an, an NPC, there's either a little bit of agreement or at least acknowledgement. Like, okay, that's fine. But Aloy is the only one that, like, is straight up no. So it's just, I don't know. It's just a lot more noticeable, maybe. Your cousin, Vashav. How long has he been a Tanakh captive? Five years. Tanakh emissaries swear he is well, but I wonder. That tribe is renowned for its brutality. How did he survive? Well, I'll know soon enough. I <laughs> have things to do. <laughs> if you see him before I do, tell him that I await him in Meridian, where he belongs. If I see him... I will. When you say years of hostility, I assume you mean the Red Raids? Ah, yes. My favorite subject. I wouldn't ask if I didn't need to know. As you know, my father raided all the border tribes. The Asarum, Banuk, and Nora suffered greatly, resisting as best they could. But none fought back like the Tanakh. They rose up and assaulted our western front at Baron Light, sweeping us from their lands. Getting them to talk to us again after that was tricky. There was a lot of speculation about her being ace, but I I read some stuff on on the Twitter verses. Say more. Oh yeah, oblivious. Like she doesn't even really notice, right? Well, you got him out of Sunfall. Any happiness he has, he owes to you. Look at this. <laughs> he's a fine young man, which he'll need to be if he's to inherit the crown. Yeah, she still struggles with people, which is relatable. First? Yes, well, I'd have to get married for that to happen. <laughs> Rod keeps throwing noble matches at me, <laughs> but I find I'm always trying to make them into someone. At any rate, I never aspired to the throne, and I don't wish to sit there forever. When Edaman comes of age, I hope to step aside. Free of the crown. I might finally be able to travel the world. Who knows? Perhaps even accompany you on one of your adventures. You make it sound easy. Okay, time to go. I need to get going. Uh, one moment, Aloy. There's something I must ask you. Since you left, I've thought of little else. This isn't really the time. But it has to be. The way you left before, there's no way to know when I'll see you again. I'm not trying to stop you. Or hold you back. But I need to know. <laughs> I know, I'm starting to get uncomfortable. Will you return to Meridian? And stay? But long enough for us to spend time to get to know each other properly perhaps um <laughs> oh i forgot i don't like doing these <laughs> i i don't want to be mean but also like take a hit <laughs> okay now's not the time now's not the time God, the, the situation calls for a a higher perspective. Let's circle back the threat I'm after the new year. It's not just Meridian, but a lot of other places too. A lot of innocent people. Or just go with the fist else. every time. I don't want to be mean to him because he seems like a really nice guy. At least, not yet. You're right. 
I'm acting like a fool. It's supposed to be the king who calls for a higher perspective. Please accept my apology. And my wishes for your success. Goodbye, Aloy. As always, our hopes ride with you. Well, he had to shoot his shot. He had to at least try, guys. <laughs> the only thing missing out is chat integration to make chat do all the rejections. Exactly. Sometimes none of the choices feel right, yeah. And it's hard to really say what the choices... Like, exactly what was going to happen. Because, like, the compassionate one... I would like to go for the compassionate one, but I wouldn't want to give him any... I wouldn't want him to... I don't know. Feel like he has a chance. Queen Masari. Blessed champion. Itaman, what do you say? Oh, she's so pretty. My humblest thanks to you, great champion, for delivering my mother and me from Sunfall, and for defending our holy city against the forces of shadow. Did I say right? <laughs> oh, cute. You fine, Devin. And you're welcome. Champion, will you teach me how to shoot like a real machine hunter? It's a man. I, uh... I have to go on an important mission, Prince. To save the world? Something like that. But when I come back, I could give you a few tips. It would be an honor. We owe you our lives, champion, and we will not forget. May the sun light your way. Watch out for Thunderjaws, champion. Watch out for Thunderjaws, he said. I don't know if I ever would... I don't know. We're doing it. We're doing a big playthrough. So let's enjoy it. Be flattered by the statue. It feels wrong. Especially when my job's only half done. Hmm. How long has she been gone that they were able to get this statue up? A short amount of time. So much detail. She's gone six months. Oh, that's long enough for a statue, I think. I don't know. The little kid is actually really adorable. <laughs> you were almost overrun by the machines Hades controlled. Oh, we this is still them. here. Bellow back. Hmm. Anything else in this area? I don't know. Look. Looks like a memorial. Honoring those who fell in the Battle of the Alight. Lots of brave people defended this place from Hades. All right. Go another one up here to talk to you. You spend a stupid amount of time in this area running around looking for secrets and not finding all that much. I think I just didn't I didn't uh do a lot of these extra talking stuff and talking bits, but Luthid, Fanasha. Thanks for being here. Wouldn't miss it. Even if you did I love this color of purple that they have on. She has on. She's here now, isn't she? For the moment. But I see that look on her face. She's got business to attend to. And it isn't in Meridian. You know, I didn't vanish before because I wanted to. I had- No, Huntress. Please. You don't have to justify yourself to us. You saved our butts. If you've got to go, go. With our blessing. Always. How have you been? You did all- oh, yeah, you did talk to everyone. You did all the things, yeah. Yeah, as a, as a streamed game, it was- it was at the time, because I was doing a lot of games at the time, it was kind of hard to- to be able to- like, it was kind of like, I need to do it and finish it and move on to the next thing, but now, because I spend so much time game dev, these things, like, I want to take my time with these things. You both look like you're doing well. Mr. Shiny Pants here is now the Sun King's senior military advisor. That means people actually have to listen to him talk. May the sun bless their sorry souls. At least <laughs> I say something of substance every once in a while. What was that? I just fell asleep while you were talking. 
And how about you, Hiroshi? <laughs> I've been looking after Nasadi and Edaman, two parts bodyguard, one part bad influence. <laughs> huh. I was gonna say nanny, but I like your version better. Edaman. I never pictured you as a nanny. Edaman must be special. Hold on. You love uh, Vinasha? I do too. Nasadi was the mad Sun King's wife. She has enemies. I've had to foil a plot or two. Right. You can try to hide it, but inside, you're as soft as a silk pillow. Oh, you have no idea. Huh? Oh, dear. Uh, we were <laughs> talking about Edaman? Yeah. Okay, I admit it. Edaman's cute. He's fun. And he looks up to me. I like him. Except when he forgets to wash his hands after hooking worms in that muddy garden behind a solarium. Blech. Yeah, I like her sass. It's been months since I was in Sunfall. What's become of the Shadow Karja? <laughs> After you wiped out the Eclipse, there were hardly any priests or officers left to terrorize the little people. Avad offered amnesty to all who were forced to serve the Shadow. So the commoners cleaned out the Citadel and handed it back to him. The Sundom was unified. Avad wanted Uther to take command of the garrison there, but Captain Cudley here refused. Rumor has it that he wanted to stay close to me here in Meridian. <laughs> That's nonsense, of course. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I know. It's making him. She is. Out. Go away with you. Always an honor, champion. Always a pleasure. But please, little huntress, come back someday and tell us about your adventures. If I can't get in trouble, at least I can hear about yours. Hey. Love the side combo? Yeah, that was really good. Spells and Master Override. Oh, nice! Oh, right. The resonator thing. I never used that. I think, because didn't you... Master override installed. With the resonator, didn't you have to like hit it with an arrow or something after you did it? Up and release energy. Uh, resonator should help in a fight. Looking sharp as ever. <laughs> right back at you. Oh gosh. Are you ready to go? Or do you need a little more time? I'm ready. Time to go. Then R2 to transfer that energy to an enemy. And just, and then shoot it. Okay. Yeah, I think I just never, I was bad at aiming. I, think. I better get going. But I watch me tear watch. shit up. Well, it obviously. Like it's Aloy. Tanakh, as you said. Warrior tree, okay. Where exactly is this embassy going to be held? Past the dawns, the canyon that marks the western border of the Sundom. Hey, where is the this at in the U.S.? Light at its farthest edge. The embassy will take place just beyond its gates. It's a long march, a fortnight on foot. A couple of days hard riding should get us there. Actually, it might be better to rest here tonight. Head out in the morning. Of course. Mm-hmm. You saw it in her face. Oh, we're in Utah. Okay. I don't know why I thought we were in Kansas or something. <laughs> He's just got a rat. He cut up something. This game is really gorgeous. Beautiful game. Welcome back, Star Fox. Toto, I don't think we're in Kansas anymore. Oh, my 
He was whittling. <laughs> I like how they redid these areas that, like, that was Maker's End back there, right? And this is, what do you call it? Like how they, I like how they, Sunfall, yeah, I like how they re redid them. I don't know. Maybe I just didn't really notice all the all the little things. Your my first playthrough. I'm dumb, yeah. <laughs> no, he's saying yeah to me. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> it's kind of a convoluted path on the old map. Do you think that they just meant to do it so they could show us the old places? It probably doesn't make sense. Definitely, yeah. Horizon Forbidden West. Sparks to steel. <laughs> Never seen anyone use one of those to get around. Is that how I get to Baron Light? Uh, yes, I mean, usually, but not today. Uh, not yet. And why is that? Well, the Daunt. The whole valley. It's infested with machines. We can take care of that. <laughs> I can handle machines. Oh, I'm oh. Sure you can, but uh, I'm under strict orders not to operate until the whistle down at Chain Scrape sounds the all clear. Look, I didn't come all this way just to stand around and wait. I'll crank that car down myself if I have to. Well, but then <laughs> who would crank it back up? Fine, fine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's funny. You can't wait for the third game? Yeah, same. I like how they set it up Though, really so obviously for a third asked, game, too. Might be best to say you forced me. Oh, this is where the speed run starts. But not a lot of activity. Smoke's probably coming from something the machines wrecked. Well, Talking quiet, to the savior what... of Meridian. Well, exactly. Okay. What are... in effect because of all the fuss. What sort of machines are causing the trouble? Nasty ones and lots of them. Bristlebacks they're called. The strangeness is they're not native to the dot. Just showed up. All of a sudden. What kind of safety yeah, regulations do you think are on this thing? Well, we've got hunters, <laughs> just none that want to cross A lot of skills are for specific break. weapons. Okay. He is self-appointed. Okay. Work stoppage was his idea. Yeah, well, I'm just passing through. Got an embassy to attend. 
You should have said. That ain't gonna happen no time soon. What are you talking about? You don't think they invented that yet? Hear that? Safety That's regulations? Who is that? Karja Sun Priest. Cranked him down yesterday, about an hour before the machine trouble started. He's a very important man, or so he says. That embassy at Baron Light? He's the one supposed to run it! Ha! Great. If you don't do as I say immediately, the Sun King himself shall hear of your insolence. Thanks to you. Oh, this guy. <laughs> studious, studious guy. A contraption is very impressive. He refused to transport, but not this... This... Nora girl, this savage, besides Scallywag, what is Vadis nuts, studious what is Aloy, you know, savior of Meridian, got him. Really? Well, that lessens the insult, I suppose. I came here for the embassy at Baron Light, way I hear it, so did you. Well, not with the valley infested. And so did Aramon proclaim the sun priests most precious and worthy of safekeeping. See, scripture. I shall head to Baron Light when the captain of the vanguard tells me the way is clear, and not a moment sooner. Fine. Captain's a friend of mine, you know. Where is Erend? <laughs> Wouldn't mind speaking to someone a little more action, a little less scroll. What is studious? What is studious? What is <laughs> studious? What is sent Aaron and another vanguard out at daybreak to clear the way. And so at daybreak. Hey. Oh my goodness. <laughs> hey. Down the valley then. <laughs> yeah. Said they check the ruins on the left. He lives sassy, Aloy. Yeah. Okay. I hear there's a work stoppage. Any way to upgrade my gear? I'll bet the smith and chain scrape would let you use his workbench. As for the bristlebacks, you might want to craft some acid arrows. Hitting their canisters with those will take them down quick. Thanks. I'll find Aaron and I'll bring him back. Hey! Where do you think you're going? What? To the top of the ridge. To wait in safety. Sorry. Operators under strict orders. No passengers till the whistle blows, right? That's right. <laughs> Best start cranking. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? Jorf, would you kindly escort Studious to Chain Scrape and wait for me there? You got it. I will find Erend and I will help clear a path. But after that, no more excuses. Baron Light. Embassy. If such be the will of the sun. <laughs> it will be. Trust me. I gotta find Erend, but it might be good to hit Chain Scrape first and upgrade my bow. Vaudis. Studious Vaudis. Studious. Vaudis. Vaudis. Studious. <laughs> Thank you for installing the Burning Shores DLC. We'll do that later. Okay. New skills are available at any time. Ghost levels will be returned upon reaching the new max level. Let's quick save. Vodies. <laughs> you've been doing it so it's been so long since you've done this. It's fun to see all the dialogue scenes again. It's also kind of why I want to I want to play I want to do a casual Horizon Zero Dawn play run through again because I'm like, I kind of want to watch the story, but can I do it? 
No, I don't need rocks. We got seven ro Oh, we have seven rocks. We don't need rocks. Okay, so I do have to beat the game first. Okay, gotcha. Do you have do you have a split called Vadi's Nuts? I can turn this around. Oh my god, I wasn't paying attention! Oh my god, I was I'm so sorry. I wasn't paying attention. Please don't kill me. I didn't realize. Oh my goodness. I I I'm guys. I didn't realize. Oh. It would be helpful if we could shoot at things. Oop. I didn't can we? Can we? I've missed every single shot, Corey. What are you doing? Oh god. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness, Cory. Be better. Be better at playing this game. One more. One more are ya. Where you go? I see you. Oh, I missed. all the rocks. <laughs> Honestly, I think that stealth is not a bad idea for me. I don't know if you guys can see how bad my shot is. Stealth is probably not a bad idea for me in Ultra Hard, so uh, rocks might not be a bad idea. Mm, I can refill my pouch with these later. You had to do a lot of stealth fighting, yeah. That's how I feel. Green shine. I'm actually wondering. Oh, yeah. A rare and valuable resource. Upgrading certain weapons and outfits or trading with Swiss. I think I remember that. Um. Machine. It must be a bristleback. Oh God. <laughs> that must be chain scrape. Drew said I could get my bow upgraded in there. Go oh, upgrade our bow. I'm gonna take that rock up though. Ground soaked with acid. Did the bristlebacks do this? Okay. Outlander approaching. Is that the savior? That the savior? Welcome That's me! Savior. Hello! Who would like Welcome to come to in? Trip, savior. Open up, guys. Dwarf's orders. Good enough for me. Say thank you, Aloy. By the forge. Petra? Petra? Aloy, what are you doing here? Excellent guarding. About time there was something worth looking at in this dump. It's nice to see you too. And not a moment too soon. Come on. I... Damn brewery's the only thing I can count on in this place. Yeah, I heard. Machines, work stoppage. No, oh, those are just the latest malfunctions. Chain scrape's always been a few tools short of a kit. Petra. Right. right there is the biggest tool of all. Our land, not our problem. The bristlebacks are everybody's. Roland? You've heard of him? Yeah. 
but he's a story best told over a cold beer you told Petra. you thought Petra was gonna be a main character after this segment I'm just passing through I really like though that she has these meaningful like full conversations like um like uh, Vinasha Vinasha is that her name keep moving and Petra of course bigger gears to grind she made lots of friends in Zero Dawn good to see you welcome in welcome in Aloy how are you Petra but if you want a cold beer and a few laughs with an old friend, come find me at the brewery. Your choice. You thought Petra was the best ship for Aloy? She seems like she would give her the less, least amount of pressure. Guy sounds like trouble. Maybe Petra could use some support. But first things first, I need to find that workbench and upgrade my bow. Okay. Let's see. What do we have going on here? There's some quests here we can pick up. Let's go pick up some quests. Ah. Interesting area. The beds. I like this though. You upgrade your phone every five or six years. Your father that. upgrades his phone even more than you do and always has a better phone than you do. That's my mom. My mom has like a better has a better phone than well she you she the only reason I upgraded my phone last time is because I dropped it in a river when I was tubing. And I had to. <laughs> um but my mom actually has a much better uh, phone than I do. What happened to you? That damn mine is what happened to me. <clears throat> it won't be the last century if Oven keeps shoving those tongs into those tunnels. What mine? Northeast the chain scrape, where the river ends. I told Corvin we should stop when the first cave-in happened, but <sighs> Oven probably threatened to cut off her pay. Or worse. How about you slow down and take me through it? You're constantly- Yeah, my last job, I w had to be on my phone constantly, so it was nice to have a nice phone. You mentioned you were injured in a cave-in. Yeah, <clears throat> a couple days ago. That's how I hurt this blasted leg. <laughs> Corvin and the others were opening a new vein while I was checking on an older one. As soon as the blast hit, Tunnel I was in collapsed. Might have dodged it if I wasn't running on barely a spark of sleep. We were pushing too hard and too fast. And you're afraid Corvind and the others might not be as lucky if it happens again. Mm-hmm. Hit the nail right on the head. Olvind? Olvind. How come Olvind's in charge? Don't these mines belong to the Karja? Try telling Olvin that. <laughs> in all the back to get them open. Might as well own them. Where's Menno? Menno! <laughs> Chest hair! You ask him. Oh, Menno's he probably sleeping. Well. <laughs> Who's Corvind? He's their foreman. And a damn good one. The kind that knows how to deal with management when it gets unreasonable. But Olvind. <laughs> his demands go beyond unreasonable. Corvind's been doing his best to appease him. He even blamed himself for my injury when it was Olvin who ordered the extra shifts. Sounds like a good guy. That's why we all put up with the long hours and lousy conditions. But if the whole mine becomes unstable, I'd rather suffer Olvin's wrath than die buried in rubble. Okay, might be able to help. If I'm in the area. I would appreciate that. Thank you. You're welcome. You've never played Horizon Zero Dawn, even though you have it. You should play it. It's really good. It's my favorite game of the last generation of consoles. I'll see 
extra stock for later. Wait, I don't want to walk. Maybe I wait until I get a mount. Oh, you're level 94. Oh, gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha. Probably should give it a go. Yeah. It's a really good game. It's really good, Sid. Play it! Okay. I'm gonna wait till I get a mount, so I just don't want to do that hole. But I'm gonna go pick up these other quests. Should we play some machine strike? Hey Milda. Milda. I took some of your stew last time I went into the wilds. Kept me going for a week. Felt like I could have put a strider in a sleeper hold. <laughs> Enjoy it while it lasts. Sounds like you're serving up some uh, impressive provisions here. Don't touch the food, Aloy! can have the discount too, but you'll have to come back later. I think you have me confused with someone else. Olven didn't send you? No. Oh, my apologies. It's just that his minions won't stop pestering me. <sighs> now I've even worn out my special grill. Since I'm in the midst of a crisis, perhaps you could skip to what it is you wanted? Some of your food? Of course. Are Alvin's people causing you problems? Oh, yeah. They constantly demand my best, but the equipment I need to make my signature dishes isn't built for batch cooking. And don't get me started on the Olven discount they feel so entitled to. And if you refuse? I make meals, not trouble. Hmm. <laughs> okay. How did you end up in Chainscape? Heard about a new and upcoming town at the edge of the frontier. Where there's a town, there's a tavern. I was in need of work. So I got myself out here and started cooking. Some of these people had never tasted proper boars and berries stew before. Boars and berries anyway, stew. Next thing I knew, people kept coming back. Guess they like my food. Or the ale. Your last customer mentioned your cooking really kept him going out in the wild. Where I'm headed, I could use some of that. I would be happy to oblige, especially since you have the decency to ask pleasantly. But? But my special groove griddle is no more. Without it, I can't cook any of my signature dishes. I hate to think what'll happen when I'm forced to refuse Olven or his goons. Even if I already had the right ingredients, there's nothing I can do. We we'll just make you a new griddle. Unless you can source me a temporary replacement? What do you need? For the ingredients. A few pieces of decent wild meat, and I'd say a big handful of bitter leaf stems. That'll do. As for the griddle, a corrugated metal panel might suffice until I can have a new one forged. You'd likely find one in a scrounger pile if you follow the river to the northeast. Don't worry, I'll clean it first. <laughs> You'll have no issue finding boars and bitter leaf on your way, assuming you're as much a hunter gatherer as your clothing suggests. Thanks, Mildiff. I'll keep an eye out. So that's what gratitude sounds like. <laughs> oh, Milda. Don't let anyone push you around. Yeah, don't let anyone push you around, Milda. You'll play when I when I run 7R. I can't run 7R. When do I have 5 and a half to 10 hours to sit down and play a game? Sid. You have a PS5. Oh, nice. So you are able to experience Forbidden West at its peak. The bristlebacks threaten us all. What do you want, Olven? Some kind of payment? My dear magistrate, you think I can be bought? If you want that whistle blown, all you have to do is have your soldiers remove the bristlebacks and sign the concession decree. Face it. What other choice do you have? <clears throat> Hi. Hi. Savior, what auspicious timing. Might we discuss a matter of importance to the Sundom? We might. Later. Very well. I 
shall be waiting. So, the savior herself. Walloper of Durval, gutter of Helis. Maybe. Gutter of Helis. I've Helix. heard many tales of your beauty and heroics, my fierce lady warrior. Ulfrent Freehold, at your service. So, what could have dragged you away from the fine silks and wine of Meridian to this smudge of a settlement? Your saviorly attention must be needed elsewhere. I'm here for the embassy and- The embassy? Why, uh, by the forge. Ah, greater gears for greater matters. Guess that means you'll be moving on. Once I've dealt with any problems around here that need my saviorly attention. Ah, the bristlebacks, of course. Got to get rid of them if you want that embassy to take place. Well, best get to it, hey? Not, <laughs> so. Not so fast. You and the Karja. You don't seem to have a high opinion of the magistrate. Well, I refuse to play nice to some fancy robed parchment pusher when my fellow laborers are being bullied, intimidated, and taken advantage of. How noble of you. Noble? Ha! Born with a hammer in hand, I was. Nobody handed me anything or dropped opportunity into my lap. Everything I've achieved, I've done on my own. Mm -hmm. And where is this hammer now? The uh, burden of leadership forced me to set it aside. The Karja risk nothing while demanding that good Osram gamble with their lives out there. Someone had to step up and say no more. Good night, Viola. Thanks for coming in with the raid and hanging out. I'm also always. I'm also going to be done after this. Indeed, I did. We're laborers, not soldiers. Until the Karja clean up their mess and give us the fair deal we deserve, I'm not risking Osram lives. Fair deal? You mean your concession decree? <laughs> it's not my decree. It's on behalf of all the good Osram laborers of this land who do all the backbreaking work while only the Karja reap the rewards. All we're asking for is the ability to share in this prosperity for a land worked by the people for the people. For the people! That's and just how much would be your share? Only an amount appropriate to my contributions to this community, uh, of course. And who appointed you? If Chainscrape is on Karja land, shouldn't a Karja be in charge? Who appointed you? The sensibilities of good Osram folk, of course. You think a Karja can head this whole venture? Ah! The Magistrate can barely make the trek from Baron Light without losing a few screws. So you have no real authority, then? People only follow you because you say so. Loudly. Anyone who has followers has authority. I've been with Chainscrape from the beginning. I mean, I'm practically its founder. Practically, it's he says. Folk know I'm indispensable to its success. Founding? You said you founded Chainscrape. Somehow I doubt that. Practically founded, I said. I alone saw its potential when it was just a smattering of tents in Baron Light's shadow. I invested in the mine, convinced some friends back home to do the same, and here we are. You could say Chain Scrape is what it is, thanks to me. Oh, so you're not just standing around and profiting off everyone else? Not at all. Sure, I make a little return on my investment here and there, mm -hmm. but my main priority, as it was from the beginning, is to look after the well-being of these honest working Osram. Where's the whistle? Right in the middle of town, but with the threat out there, I'm not endangering innocent Osram lives. I'm going to clear out the bristlebacks. And when I'm done, this valley is going to get moving. If that's what it takes. Until then, I'll keep looking after the safety of these good folk. Just be ready to blow the whistle. Better see what that Karja magistrate wanted. I bet he's in the tavern. Okay. Oh. Wait, what is this? Oh wait, that's the Karja magistrate. That's not who I want to talk to. We want to go here.
Seems like bitter leaf likes to grow on rocky terrain. Bitter leaf. Oh. Hello. Nice. It's green like blaze, but it's hard and shiny. Bitter leaf. Merchants would be interested. I think there's another one over there. Nice. Okay. There's our three bitter leaf. We just need to find some boars. Okay, I think I have enough bitter leaf. I love this. Do you see this? Like the, the rapids right here. That's so good. That's so good. That's the mission? That sounds boring. Womp womp. There's some boars in here. Boars? Ooh, boar! Oh. Boar, come back. Please. Please. Don't. Boar. Boar. Why, why do you- why do you have- why do you have so much health, Boar? Oh my god. <laughs> hey. Where did the boar go? Did he not die? Is this the boar over here? Oh my goodness. Yes, I should tag them. It's a tanky boy. I am playing on ultra hard. Did they up the difficulty of boar in ultra hard? <laughs> There's a boar. Butthole! Get him- shoot him in the butt! I think I shot her. Bone. Another boar here. Okay. Wait, what is this? River Bloom? Come back, boar. I miss that. You're running so far. Stop running. Come back. I'm not even trying to kill you. Charge heavy attacks are great for boars. Okay, we'll charge heavy attack our boar. I know that wasn't a boar, but I don't know. Maybe we need the meat for something. I feel like it's always good to to get some meat sometimes. Oh, there's a thing over there. I should probably not. There's a bird. Hello? Oh, I have to go here. Oh, I got it all? I didn't realize I'd gotten it all. No, you don't see me. You don't see me. You don't see me. 
I am invisible. I am in. Oh my god. Okay, let's not run up on these boys. They can kick my butt. Just need to go in there. Where am I trying to go? Scroungers. I might have said I could find a metal panel in one of their scrap piles. To go in one of these scrap piles. So you, I just need you to get away from the scrap pile. Can you go over there? Why can't I get in the scrap pile? No, 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 pal. I will check another scrap pile. Somebody sees me. Can you guys just go like over there somewhere? Over there. They see me. In the horizon, you are never done. I feel like somebody's gonna see me here. Yeah. Yeah. This is not good. Oh my goodness. I almost had that too. Okay, let's go. Let's get out of here. Run, 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 run. Run. Run, 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 run. Run. Cory, we have it. Just run. You got this, Aloy? Oh. Oh my god. Nobody knows. Just what I need. Oh my god, they're still after me. It's okay. I wanted to do the thing, but maybe not when I'm running. They know I'm here. Oh, they see me. Nope, we gotta go. Bye. 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 Actually, I need something off of these burrowers. Should I, should I take it? Uh. Oh my god, you scared me. I, that didn't hit him at all. Oh shit. Oh shit. I can't believe that got me. Oh, he's down, but I don't think I'm gonna make it there in time. Oh my god, really? I'm stuck on a rock. Alright, he's down.
Oh my god, I've missed every single shot. Love that for me. Ooh. Oh, he's found me. to get that weak spot. I think I need it. He's down, but... So just this. He's down, but are we gonna get there in time is the question. Nope. I will do this. <laughs> Don't go swimming, Aloy. I feel like you're gonna start swimming. Don't swim. Oh, we did it. Nice. So I think I need something off of... I can't remember. Oh, I do. What is it that I need? I think it's a purple thing. Last pace, primary nerve. I don't know. Alright, let's go turn this in and then I'll be done for the night. Hello, Milduff. I've got the things for you, my friend. Ah, there you are. I happen to receive another visit from Olven himself. He was pushy, but I stood my ground. And oh, say, good job, Milduff. I got my own back. Yes, I did. I'm listening. When I made his meal, I used three pinches of salt <laughs> instead of two uh, each journey begins with a single step i guess <laughs> i think i have everything you asked for then just as you have inspired me let us see if i can return the favor time to cook That was inspired. Next time you want the best provisions, you know where to find me. And your next order of any dish will be on the house. <laughs> Thanks. And don't forget to stand up for yourself. Funny you should say that. As it happens, I'm already cooking up my next portion of resistance. Hope to see you again. <laughs> Okay, go save. 